Hi everyone, it's Ashley. I'm kind of apologize if I'm a little groggy, but this is my first vlog here on YouTube. And basically, it's just to tell you guys, or show you guys a little bit about what I go through on a daily basis living with the chronic disease that I do. And the disease that I have is called systemic lupus. It's my main diagnosis. There are other things involved, but I'm not going to go ahead and get into that because I want to talk about lupus and spread a little bit more awareness so people really start understanding and knowing what it is and what it does to me and other people out there who have it. Let's start off by saying I'm 20 years old. That means nine years, nine, since I was diagnosed with systemic lupus. And it's been a rough road uh, so far. You know, I've had ups and downs, but uh, overall it's been pretty rough. Um, I can tell you that when I was first diagnosed with lupus, I didn't even know what it was. I thought these people were insane. I didn't want to take my medicine. I didn't want to do anything. And then I got really sick. And I faced kidney failure because of it. So, at least that was resolved and I started taking my medication. And little by little, I got better. And all my swelling went down. And... I started taking care of myself a little bit better, but I had maybe three years where my disease didn't really touch me at all, and I only had to take like maybe one medication, which was something that was so wonderful because during that time, I was able to forget about the fact that I have a disease and how debilitating it is sometimes, um, but here I am again in the hospital sick and I look completely different than I normally do and I'm having some very complicating cases the doctors are really trying hard to you know help me but I'm kinda just sitting around and waiting because they don't really know what they're supposed to do no one really knows anything about what lupus does why it does what it does what it is so they're trying all these different options, even um, discussing giving me some chemo. They're going to wait, give me some more steroid infusions before they start that. One thing I'm not excited about is I'm starting to lose my hair again. It's right there. And so I'm losing my hair. And I lost a little bit last year, but this is... It's getting pretty bad again. And my face is swollen from all the steroids. It's just not something fun. Lupus. Lupus is a terrible thing to live with. It's definitely not fun waking up every day of your life not knowing whether or not you're going to be able to get out of bed. And if you do get out of bed, you can't button your pants or dress yourself. You can barely make it to the bathroom. You can't lift your leg over the tub wall to get into the shower, let alone try to get into a car or walk down the stairs. You are literally in so much pain that you just cannot move. It's so terrible. I mean, it changes from day to day. You could be like that one day and not be able to get out of bed. The next day you're up and maybe you're able to like walk around a little bit or, or you know, get some things done around the house, which that kind of leaves a lot of misunderstanding from people around us. People see that and they're like, well, you're just lazy. No, it's not that. Yeah, I'm getting up and I'm working around the house and I'm doing things I'm supposed to be doing without, without yelling about my pain, but I still am in pain. I feel exhausted. I'm nauseated. I don't feel good altogether. I'm sure that the joint pain is not bothering me as much right now, but trust me, there are other things going on. They're just more easily tolerable when, when you don't have the severe joint pain.